Alright, what's up guys? Master Smiley here. Uh, I'm glad you could join me in my live stream. I'm uh, featuring the new uh, DLC contraptions. I'm sure some of you probably have DLC. Uh, I, I thought I'd just make this little stream just a little uh, about how to and just basically show you all the new materials that came for the new contraptions so uh... let's see let's um... i kinda had an idea i don't know if you guys um... let me see here if you're new to my channel you know you can uh... take a look down in the description I'll actually i'll link, link in the description after i'm done streaming uh, I have videos on each of these, you know, this whole build here. And let me give you a quick guide, or a <laughs> quick guide, a quick tour. Let me see here. Yeah, this is the, <coughs> when before the Far Harbor DLC came out, I decided to, you know, just, you know, build this. Just to keep my anxiousness at bay went for the far harbor so yeah I have the build videos to these uh, you can check out my channel I have uh, quite a few let's builds let's plays uh, just a few let's streams so here's this here's the uh, the store of course we got liquor food clothing but uh, apparently out of stock this little space is for rent. And uh, ammos, guns, and checkout counter. So just nothing too fancy, just simple. So this is my little Far Harbor theme. And uh, I'm thinking about building in here. So, um, here, let me show you guys this. I got Deadpool here. Uh, here's my little fortress. Uh, this is what I first built when I first started playing the game. I didn't know what to build or anything like that, so I just decided to make this. I still get confused, too, how to get up there, because I know there's, yeah, back staircase. Just my little power armors. You can see I have quite a, I have quite a collection of power armors. Those are uh <clears throat> you can just go around and just explore and you can just find these and then modify them. Just be sure you have all the building materials. So uh let me see, I got what else do I have here before I start building? Oh I have Mario over here too, pixel art. I'll also leave that in the description after uh, we're done streaming here. And uh, I have a tree house up there. Which I have not tried to finish building yet. Um, when I was building this, I, I ran out of uh, material and resources. So I didn't get a chance to start it again. But now, uh, probably I'll probably post a vid and finish it. So, uh... That looks about, you know, just how my sanctuary looks. Nice little tour. These are just houses I built for uh, people that come. So I just put beds down and they're not really assigned to anybody. They just, people just lay their head down wherever they want. Sort of like uh, wanderers and shit. Wastelanders. I'm really glad that you're trying so hard to make the call. Oh, that kid's creepy to me, man. That's like the creepy little addition to this game so okay without any further ado let's go let me show you the new materials uh, here's my building that I was making uh, it's supposed to be a mall so we'll try to keep this mall themed all right okay first of all <clears throat> I'm sure you guys are familiar with most of these materials so let me start from here. Uh, you know, the usual specials. 
Then the structures. Okay, we got the wood. You know, you guys know about that. I'm sure you guys know about the metal, the concrete. So here's the new, one of the new ones so far. The first one would be the, it's, it's the warehouse parts. So some of these are, are makeshift pre-made already. And then there's pieces here that you can, I guess, you know, obviously you can build your own. Trust me, these all fit. Even sometime if you're off a little, uh, there's always ways. And then here's the floor. This is, a, I guess it's a brick. <clears throat> a brick with the, uh, I don't know if there's wooden or it might just be a concrete floor. But here's a, uh, it's apparently wooden. Another little skinny little. I think this would be good for like a pathway or like a, you know, more floors. Grilled. Okay. Not too bad. Then we got the walls. It just looks like the regular walls that came with the woods. But this one's got more seems like more damages. <coughs> more wood more wear and tear, excuse me. By the way, if you're new to this stream and new to this channel, you know, drop a like, comment, and uh be appreciated if you subscribe. And uh check out my other videos, man. I got a lot of bills. So these ones look pretty much the same as the wooden shed like um, aluminum materials. Windows, glass. Kind of like the barn. I don't know if you guys, uh, some of you seen the, or if you guys have the other DLC. Um... Wasteland Workshop, I think it was. I forget. Where we get all the barn pieces. This is sort of the same. So here's the roof. <clears throat> Let's see. Kind of these are all slanted with holes. Just like the, yeah, these are just like the barn pieces. So obviously, you know, it's like a warehouse and it's just like a bigger version. Okay, so here's the barn. I'm sure you guys seen that. And here's something new, uh, scaffolding. Here's a pre-made structure, which I can't put in here because I'm inside this building. And uh, here's another pre-made structure. By the way, um, I, I've had this DLC when it first came out. And uh, I have a couple of new videos I post uh, using these new materials building like a carnival and stuff like that which I'm still in progress uh, I post it part one part two <clears throat> I'm currently working on part three but uh in the meantime I thought I'd just show you guys all the new material pieces that came with the uh, recent DLC contraptions so here are the floors let me see me go back I think you guys missed it while I was blabbing so these are the new structures here the scaffolding we got the makeshifts the floors these are obviously just wooden but they're different uh, <clears throat> what I notice is they're all shaped differently and I think these are for the scaffolds yeah these are scaffolding wood and then these are the, the poles where you can actually build your own they come in different heights different shapes and sizes and they get taller and taller and then those pieces of wood I showed you back there, these ones can lay on top. <gasps> Excuse me, coming down with something there. Then here's the stairs. These ones are sort of like, uh, yeah, like ramps, uh, like handicap ramps and stuff like that. <laughs> uh, so these are stairs. These are nice though. They came in pretty handy on some of my bills. Because I went back on some, I seen these new pieces, so I replaced some of them. It made the, it makes the building, you know, gives you a lot more stuff to work with. So 
these are railings. I like these railings. They have those sort of like the caution stripes on the bottom. And I think it'd be so awesome if they put um like roller coasters and tracks and stuff where you can build. That'd be sweet, man. You can make your own real roller coaster shit like that. So these railings are nice. Okay, so these are I think just part of it. Let me see. Let's go move on. Yeah, the box cars. Now I haven't really built anything with these yet. Uh, I'm still going through the materials and let's see box car door. Awesome. I like these because I these can like stand up in the air. They can. Uh, it'll look nice. Sort of like a like a <clears throat> just like a fort, but lifted off the ground. So you can see, see these got legs. I think they can be extended. I'm not sure. With the yeah, see they go up. So there you go. Sorry, my bad. I forgot I was in the building. So yeah, these go pretty up, pretty high though. And the orange ones are the same. It's pretty much the same as the blue. They're just different colors. Yeah. So these are the box cars, which uh, I'm sure I'll have future vids coming out building stuff with those. So the doors, I'm not sure. Let's go through the doors. Maybe there's some new doors that I missed. No, the doors are the same. Uh, these ones are the same. And here, this is what's cool. Uh, let me go outside and show you this here. Because uh, I think it was a bad idea to start inside the building. But here, check this out. This is awesome, man. You got a two-floor elevator. Which uh, I'll probably be demonstrating these here in a bit. I'm just showing you materials now. And then I'll be hooking them up soon. So check this out. This is three-floor elevator. That's That's pretty tall. And here's a four floor. I mean, wow. I want to try these. Okay, so moving on to next. This is what I want to build. <clears throat> I want to build with this ball track. This is what I found interesting, man. This is cool. This is like the most awesome thing I've seen now because I got a lot of ideas to build with these. It's sort of like what I was saying, like a, <clears throat> like a roller coaster tracks, but these, you know, these little little steel balls and shit. <laughs> okay. Yeah, some of these have legs, and uh, as I keep going down, uh, there'll be some with um, longer, like longer, you know, their legs will be longer, extended up higher and stuff. And these are the the curves and stuff these aren't too bad but uh it's i've kind of had trouble putting them down like inside um like a little shack i made a little shack to where i, I tried to see if i could make a little but it, it wouldn't work so but there's ways uh, i'm gonna use it now here in a bit all right so these are all the curves painting on what you're gonna make and stuff not too bad, not too bad. <clears throat> okay, this is the funnel. I used one of these in my recent bills. Uh, this is the only one that I could fit inside like a little shed. But this is, looks like a Reese's. <laughs> Especially if you put it in the dirt. Look at this shit. It looks like a Reese's. But anyway, this is a... Uh, like a floor tunnel a floor funnel I mean and I haven't tried this yet I haven't tried to build anything to where I can set this up on and maybe run those little you know funnels and shit down those those little twisty things I was showing you earlier here's another one with one of those tracks built on the bottom yeah it's got the Reese's on top and here's a double so you can probably make an epic fucking 
track with these. And here's the steel, the steel ball. Yeah, let me put one down. Usually rolls. Yeah, usually rolls. Oh, it's not really now. So that's the ball. And here's the uh, ball drop. I guess you can open and there's somewhere, uh, yeah, there's electricity. I guess you just step on a switch, hook it up to a switch and something and, you know, it'll release that. And here's the legs I was talking about. Uh, these go underneath the tracks, which can be extended. This is the same way. I guess I can choose left or right I guess I'm not sure here's another release track another one right there so that's the ball tracks <clears throat> that's the only thing on this uh, I don't think there's anything new on here no these are all the same okay moving on let's see let's go down uh, I think the only new pieces were, might be here. Let me see. Let's check this. Nope. I still have trouble going through these. Okay, here you go. Here are the decorations, displays, and stuff. Uh, the cool thing I found in here is the, uh, the power armor display. I wanted to, uh, build one of those because I have a good collection of power armor. And, uh... These will come in handy, but here's the statues, like kind of mannequin kind of <clears throat> armor racks, it says. So I guess I could stand this up like, uh, let's see, let me put this in here, because I have a little, <laughs> I thought I knocked dog meat over, what the hell, he's rolling around, I thought I did that, I was like, holy shit. Okay, so this is the armor. So let's put the chick down. And I bet you I can... Uh, let's see. Let's try this. Yeah, apparel. So let's put this on him. I hope we can do this. Let's see. How can I do this? It says an armor rack. There you go. Okay, where's the mechanism? Wow. Okay, it's just like a store. I guess you can just store that. I thought it would uh, at least dress up the doll or whatever and put the armor on it. I was wrong. <clears throat> okay, moving on. Let's see. Let's go out. Watch out, dog meat. Get out of my way, man. There you go. God dang, he's still almost trapped me in there. Okay, let's get out to the street here. By the way, drop a like. Subscribe. Comment share you know maybe you can tweet somebody right now and say hey man check this dude out okay here's a display case I was talking about I'm not sure if you can put stuff in here I haven't really put these down these I haven't messed with so I'm new to this too here let's see wow okay this is like what you I don't know if you I don't want to be spoiler but I don't know if you guys into that new vault vault 180 something like that there's displays in there with you know these have skulls and damn Longfellow keeps getting in the way come on old man get out of the way okay power armor yes this is what I was looking forward to power armor display so I guess these are different color I'm not sure if they're gonna glow so let's put one down um <clears throat> let's see where do I want to put one I want to display if I want to display my power armor where would I put it let's see 
Uh, let me just put it right here. Yeah. Make sure I'm facing it the right way. Okay, there you go. Let's see. I hope I'm facing it the right way. Let me just put it here in the middle. Just so we can see how this works. All right. Oh, shit. I hate it when I do that. Okay, now let's hook this sucker up. What does it say? Five. Well, let's see. Let me just put this down. And then, uh, <clears throat> I'll, uh, we'll switch it around. Or let me just try this. I don't want no big ass generator down. Yeah, let me just put this one. Alright. Now, let me get in one of these here. Hey. Oh, shit. <laughs> I thought this power armor was empty. What the freaks? <laughs> I was going to get in there too. And it's like, hey. <laughs> wow, that was. That was. That was something. <laughs> okay, let me go across over here and get My one old of man these. taught me that duct tape could fix anything. Yeah, yeah. We all know that. Duct tape was a miracle worker. Okay, let me get one of these power armors over here. <laughs> oh, I was gonna literally get inside that power armor and here he's like hey <laughs> if I would have tried to get in there I don't know what he would have done maybe he would have tried to kill me I don't know so let's see what this does uh, is this certain way I have to stand yeah this way it's just a matter of getting it in the right place But yeah, check that out. Wow. Okay. Now that is something. Okay, let's see how many. Uh, <clears throat> let's see how much power that was taking. Okay, requires one, so I didn't need that big generator. Okay, so these are colored. There's yellow. I don't know if this is red or orange. This is blue, obviously, and this is just plain silver. So awesome. You can stand them next to each other. I think. Was that what was going on? Yeah, there you go. Wow, okay, cool. So I guess I can put all these up maybe and display all my power armors. So that's a good idea. Okay, moving on. Uh, the next one, weapon racks. Wow. Okay. This is this is this is uh new. Let me see weapon racks. Um. Let me just put one here. Well, let me demonstrate this. Let's see. Uh, I can just get out of here. Uh, inventory. Let's drop that and see what happens. Am I able to put it up there? Let's see. Come on. It's a weapon rack, right? Nope. I think it's just one of them store. Yeah, see? It's another one of them store. Uh, You can store your weapons. So instead of uh, just putting it in your armor chest, <clears throat> I guess this is just what it's for. It'd be nice if it actually, you could actually put the weapon on there, you know? Like at least two, three. That would have been sweet, man. That would have been like, wow, that's awesome. It's a breakthrough. That's a breakthrough. Nope. Okay, so let's put this away. <coughs> Alright, what's this? This is a weapon rack short. Alright. So I guess these go on the wall. Yeah, this goes on the wall. Awesome. 
So there's a lot of changes I'll probably be doing on my settlement. A lot of these cases you see here are either full of weapons. Actually, they're full of weapons. And then some of them is just full of armor. And then another one is just full of, uh, like, aid. And then I got another big uh, chest for junk. So I guess they're making it easier on us. Pack rats. So this is what these are, weapon racks. So I, you can't really hang your weapon on it. So they're just more like store areas. All right. So I think that's it for that one. Let's see. I didn't really look through the carpets. Nope. Everything's the same. I know there's a, there's a lot of new items here. Check these out. This is my favorite. These are like billboard posters, man. These are awesome. Jamaica Plain. GNN. Boss, what the fuck is that? Boss coin, phone and television service. Wow. Large coffee and jelly donuts. 30 bucks. Total power by Boston for Boston. A lot of these are probably advertisings and movie, books, whatever, billboards. Human, empathy, robotics, precision. Uh, back alley bowling. Wow. There's quite a few back alley bowling. Let's see. What are the differences? Kids leagues. Hey kids. Uh, bowling championship. All right. Unstoppables. Wow. Okay. These are going in towards the uh, comics and stuff. Hey, I can probably set this up right Some here. But I need to plug those in. Gasoline diesel fusion. Awesome. Driving fly out. Okay. Juke and driving. Mr. Pebbles. Great tortoise. Famous citrus or cigarettes. Madden's boxing gym. Wow. Boston Bugle. Yeah, a lot of these are probably, like I said, just advertisings. But they're nice, man. Here, let me pluck one in. Let me, uh, let's see. Baseball. There's some cool ones. There's some pretty wicked ones here. Yeah, have the walls have eyes. Communism. It kind of gets more dark and dark. And then it is then it's the same. It's the same, but these ones you don't have to uh hook up electricity. They're more like these are more like poster posters, like billboard posters. So I'm pretty sure it'll light up if I stick one here. Yeah. As long as you got electricity hooked up, uh, those will light up right on the spot. So we'll put this right underneath my billboard signs already. You can look me up on Twitch, Low Tech Limit. Sometimes I, I stream on there. I uh, play a lot of different games and, uh, you know, it's awesome too. And here you go. Yeah, so those are the signs. There's quite a few. So there's some where you can um, run electricity and then some that are just actually wall posters with little light lamps. And as long as you got electricity running through wherever you put it, it'll uh, pretty much light up. Okay, next one here. I'm sure you've seen all these. I know there were some new signs. Yeah, here we go. Lobster roll. You know what? I don't have no restaurant or anything here at Sanctuary. Sanctuary is just more like a build area. Gun shop sign. Wow, that's awesome. Ice cream. Toss challenge. Prizes. Cool. I'm sure there's a lot more on this too. All the... Uh, Letterings. They look big. I thought they were going to be big, but these are tiny. Um, yeah, here's a clock. Yes, this is what I was looking for. Let's go inside my little uh, 
little bachelor pad. Got another. As you can see, I got a. I got tons of freaking power armor. <laughs> okay, here, let's put this up. RC, let's put it in the bar. Yeah, let's put one. Let's put two of them up. Fuck it. Okay, we'll put one there and we'll put one here above the TV. There you go. So there's that. And uh, I don't know if you guys checked out the Far Harbor DLCs too. But there's some new material too that came with it. Like these. I don't have the material for these, but it's the corks. They're just sort of like uh, floaters. So those are the signs. And these are what came and see like the statue. Pretty much the same. Let's see, miscellaneous. I wasn't sure if I there was anything new. Yeah, these ones were the Far Harbor. You know, the hides. And then this one too. The uh Children of Adam. Okay, moving on. Let's go over here now. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to figure out what out was what else was new. I'm sure you guys have seen these. A lot of these were from the wasteland in Far Harbor. But this one looks new. Here, yeah, this one's new. Uh, firing target pulse. So I guess you can throw or shoot and it'll trigger whatever you are uh, hooking it up to. It's like a switch. Sort of like those dunk tanks when you go to uh, like a local carnival and shit like that. Here's another one. Firing target toggle. I don't know what the difference between these two. What's the difference? I guess they're just different color. There's a yellow and this one looks green or blue. And this one's new too. Power counter. What? Power counter. What the heck? Okay, so eventually we'll figure out what these are. Okay, there it is. Check it out. All right. Wow, it's getting technical here, huh? Okay, next one. I don't know what these are. Uh, if you guys know, you know, comment. You know, what the heck these are. Conduit junctions. I guess it's just maybe to run electricity. Yeah. Maybe just, yeah, it, it, to run it along like the walls, maybe. I guess so you can run your electricity on the inside instead of the outside. So there's all different shapes and sizes here. Conduit power radiator. Conduit light. Conduit, just a straight pipe like deal. Long, longer. Uh, I guess this one goes around those, you know, tight areas. Yeah, I think these are for the interior. If you want to actually run electricity inside a building, I think that's what these are for. So a lot of these are are the same as the other the power conductors but just more upgraded moving on k the lights i'm not sure if there was new lights added to this let me check let's scroll through this yeah i don't think there's any yeah there's no new lights okay let's see kuma beacon oh yeah this one's new this is a pitching machine. Um, I actually hooked this up when I first seen it. I was excited. I was like, hell yeah. You know, it's going to throw baseballs at me and shit. But the downside is here. Let me put it down. There's I, What I notice is there's no place to drop anything. Maybe if I push. There you go. Okay. Yeah, all right. So if I find a baseball, I can probably store it in there and maybe it will throw it at me and I can uh, swing. So, okay, uh, almost, almost, um, I guess I knew what I had to do with it this whole time. Okay, so moving on. 
This one's weird to me. I don't know what the fuck. This is a junk motor. I guess you just fill it with junk and... It'll launch it, I guess. Maybe launch, like... I don't know. Scatter material and kill people and stuff. But it's pretty beast, man. It looks, looks beast. Next one. Firework mortar. Wow, okay. Fireworks. Okay, let's... Hey, let's hook one of these up. Let's go... Let's go fuck with this. Uh, let's see. Let's, let's go upstairs. Um, let's see. Yeah, let's go upstairs. All the way to the top. <coughs> yeah, this is... I'm trying to build something here, so... I don't want to give it away. But here, let's, let's put these down right here. Um, there's two of them, right? Yeah, there's two. There's an angled one. Okay, we'll put one here. Just to be fair, I'll put two in each square. A firework mortar can be loaded with firework shells, which it will then fire as long as it has power. You can change the firing delay by using a terminal connected to the same power grid. Okay. Firework shells of different types can be crafted at a chemistry station or can create them using the pyrotechnics mill builder. Okay. So I got to figure out what the hell I just read. But uh, we'll do by trial and error here. So I guess I got to fill them up with uh, powder or whatever. So I'm not sure if that already does it on its own. Or, you know, let's see. Ah, shit. Alright, that's good. That's good. Alright, let's hook up a small little generator. Tiny little bastard here. Alright, let's do this. Wow. Yes, I can't wait. But I think I have to uh, hook up like a... Oh, uh, shit. Come on. There you go. Okay. Um... Okay, launches firework shells when powdered. Shells can be crafted at a chemistry station. Oh my god. I went and put all this shit down and I don't even... I don't even have anything to load it with. Yep, I don't. Okay, so I guess that's a bust. Okay, I'm just gonna leave those and um, I'll fuck with it later. Okay, moving on. That was a bust. Okay, the next one is like a... It's a hoop switch. I guess you can... I don't know how this works. Uh, most likely with the ball track. If you uh, make a track going down and have that thing fall... Yeah, it'll, it'll trigger some stuff. Yeah, see? You could just... Again, this one, I think... You have to have actual generator. You can't just put it on the wall that... Has electricity running through. Okay, moving on. Powered speakers. I guess you can talk or hear people talk through these. I haven't tried any of these yet. I have yet to use these. But I'm just showing you. Cycling light. Use a connected terminal to access additional functionality. I guess this can change colors. Wow. This is first. So this is obviously new. Okay, moving on. Oversized Nixie tubes. See, I don't even know what this is for. Obviously, we know what all this is for. Okay, moving on. The neon lights, there's nothing new. But here's logic gates, which I... Transmit power if all inputs have power. Okay. I don't know what this means. I guess you can just put it down and... Okay, here you go. 
Use logic gates to create more sophisticated setups with the power grid. Logic gates have two points to attach wires, input and output. There are two basic types and or or whatever. These gates act like switches. They transmit power or not depending on the combination of power to their inputs. Wow, I don't want to read all that. I'll just leave it up on the screen real quick. Drop a like, subscribe, check out my videos, man. I've got like uh, Let's Builds on the Sanctuary. I actually built like a whole freaking settlement, <clears throat> but they're all in video parts. Uh, I did sort of a tour at the beginning of this, but I'll probably do another another tour. Uh, I got some pixel art that I've done of Deadpool and uh, Mario and uh a few others check out my videos uh i've got some pixel art that i've done okay let's get out of here and look get back to the ground and continue our okay so that's that there's all types of those so I guess the more power or, you know, whatever. Okay, this is what I thought is cool right here. These are, uh, let's see here. Oh, shit. Conveyor belts. Like, a, yeah, like a manufacturer. These are awesome, man. So basically, you can build your own factory. You can probably just make your own fantasy corporation and stuff but these are awesome man these are these are cool yeah I think they work once you hook up the main if you just hook up the mains yeah they'll all work these are all pieces again you can build whatever the heck you want all of this stuff they all do connect Sometimes you fuck it up, but still they will somehow everything will connect So these are Wow, I wonder if they actually go through there Like from the top and come out from the bottom or some of them go from the bottom and go up to the top Okay laser tripwire Wow, this is cool So there's two different types Takes fiber optics, steel, crystal, and fusion cells. Wow. Okay, sh I'm gonna definitely build some stuff with this. Okay, next one. Power manufacturing machinery. Wow, builds variety of basic objects from its inventory when powered. Use a connected terminal to set what to build. Wow, okay. Um, I'm kind of curious about this. So let me go through this and we'll hook this up. Uh, Bill's armor from inventory. Bill's basic weapons from its inventory when powered. Use a connected terminal to set what to build. Bill's clothing from its inventory when powered. Use a connected terminal to set what to build. Bill's energy weapons from its inventory when powered. Energy weapons. Huh. Heavy weapons, ammunition, mines, or grenades. Wow, I don't have material for this. Oh no, I have to be demolition expert, rank two. Okay, well, it gives me something to work towards. Demolition expert, okay, move on. Uh, pyrotechnics mill, Bill's firework shells. Okay, so. We'll do this, okay? We'll build this one, and we'll see if that's what I need to go up to that rooftop and get that fireworks thing going. Food processor. <laughs> Creates a variety of processed foods from its inventory when powered. Use a connected terminal to set what to create. Awesome. This is cool, man. Like I said, you can build your own, uh... You can build your own fucking factory. Okay, let's mess around with this. Uh... Let's see, where's the open area? Yeah, we'll start here. Man, boom. 
okay. A builder is used to create new objects out of the objects in its inventory. You can place objects into into it directly or attach a conveyor belt to fill item to feed items into it automatically. The builder will continue to create new objects as long as it has power and the required objects or components in its inventory. Change build creates, use a terminal connected to the same power grid, okay. Um before I power it, yeah, let me put down the uh, the little monitors. Let's see, let's move to the next one real quick. Wow, okay, this one drops collect inventory out the bottom when powered. Oh, okay. So I guess this is where the end product comes. Sorts incoming objects when powered based on its current inventory. Okay, so I think to manufacture to manufacture what I want to make I have to have the items again to probably build the firework shells but I don't know yet I'm just looking through these sorts incoming object component they contain based upon current inventory stores objects delivered by conveyor belt okay pulls items out of an adjacent container when powered I don't know what the freak that means Okay, let's power up this sucker here. Um, where was that terminal? Yeah, there it is. Okay, we'll just set it here. Don't matter. Nah. Four. Requires four. Okay, so we'll put this baby down. I'm going to remove these anyway, so I'm not going to keep these here. And, uh... <clears throat> let me see. Let's, okay. So I was gonna go there first and then to there. Okay, let's see what we can make here. Curious about this. Power tech this meal control. Select time manufacture firework shells, crackle, palm gold, palm silver, blue, green, pink, red, yellow. Wow, okay. Um let's try Holy shit, look at that rain, rad storm, rain, emergency flare shells. Okay, let's, um, let's try the rain. Okay, required components would be adhesive, cloth, fertilizer, and silver. So do I have enough? Um. Yeah. Socket automatic, firework shell. Okay. So did it make it? Okay, let's make another one. Um let's do the rad storm. Select item you manufactured. New bill, adhesive, cloth, fertilizer, nuclear material. Okay, go ahead, make that. All right, so it's making those. Is it gonna? Did it bring it out? Keep saying to myself, I should settle down someday. Oh shit! Auto save. Okay, let me see how this works. Let me put a. Uh, uh, where is it at? Where is it at? Where is that? Where is it at? Where I put it? Okay. Uh, conveyor belt, elevated power junction. Yeah. Man, we'll hook it up to this sucker. Come on. Okay, I'll just run it straight to there. Okay, so this is running. So where's my item? Did it? Did I set it up the wrong way? Psycho mill scrap. No, I don't want to scrap it. I want to know. Okay, I guess we have to figure out how to build shit with this. So obviously it's not building anything for me right now. Okay, moving on. Next one, we got the marquee arrow. This is more like um, like a just just like a regular street sign. 
You know, they'll point all different ways. Up, down, left, right, left, right. And here's a sign. This one looks nice. I like this. It gives it that old, like, uh, motel, seedy motel feeling. And it lights up. It just lights up like normal. Let's see. Let me take this over here and we'll light it up. Uh, just give you an idea what it looks like. Yeah, there you go. And then there's, then it comes with these little, um, these little words, like, not words, but letters and shit. You know, A through Z, A through whatever, one through zero. And then you got dollar signs, uh, star. So that's the sign. Here, let me scrap these. <clears throat> the reason why I scrap too, if you guys maybe are curious, like why are you scrapping it? Why don't you just store it? If you store it, uh, here, let me show you here. Okay, I'm gonna put this down. And you see how I get that click? I'm actually getting XP every time I put one down. Okay, so I put three down. Okay, so I'm gonna store all these three here. Now, when I go to put them down again, I'm not going to get no XP. See? Because you're just recycling over. Now, I'm going to get start getting XP now when I put it down. See? That's the difference. That's why I like to scrap everything. Because uh, since I'm a builder and I like to build stuff, um, I like to scrap it, and that way I can level up at the same time. And uh, But just be sure you have a lot of material if you want to do that. Okay, let's move on. That's the sign. Uh, let's see. I haven't looked at these yet. I don't know if, these, if there's anything new on these. Heavy laser. I'm not sure if this was already... Uh, there, but we'll, let's test this out. Requires two. And just hook that up. So then we just need enemies to come around and boom. Okay, this is the same missile turret. Alright, traps. I've done some traps. Uh, I've made quite a few traps at the castle um, I didn't make no video of that that was when DLC first came out and uh, I don't know why I didn't capture them okay here's a stationary gun let's see let's put this down wow <laughs> it's just it's just uh, shooting okay I I don't see no water no new vegetables or anything I uh, see resources tubs bells this is creepy man I don't know if you guys tried the bells on their settlements but Everybody gathers around you. It's like, whoa. Okay. Oh, this is cool. This is a pillory, man. You can actually probably um, set one of your settlers in here. Let me see. Let me put this down somewhere and we'll stick somebody in there. Uh, yeah, we'll put it right next to here. Okay, who shall we put in there? That old lady's always an asshole. Let's find her. Or this dude. Okay, I grabbed him. I think I grabbed him. And a sign. Yes, he's coming over. Come on over, boy. Come to Papa. Timeout trophy. I earned me a timed out trophy. 
So let me get out of this and make sure that guy comes over. Otherwise, he's going to die. I'm going to kill him. Come on. Come over here and get in your punishment. Wow, he's not coming over here. What the freaks? Oh, there he comes. Here, let me move this over. That way, you know, we don't, it doesn't get in his way. <laughs> Come on. Come on. I know you're scared. Look at he's hesitating. He's like, no, I can't. In the Commonwealth. Yeah, sh I should have put him in there. You're unstoppable. I should do that. Hey, go over there. Go, go, go. Come on. We got a few viewers that want to see you get put in that shit. Come on. He's not going. You know what? Let me bring it to him. Let me bring it to him. I'm going to put it right here. And I'm going to put him in there. Come on. Get in there. Come on, get in there. Wow, it's not working. There he goes. Wow. Command. Assign. Come on, wasting time. Get in there, goddammit. He's not getting in there. Fuck this. Okay, uh, let's keep moving on. Yeah, that would have been awesome, man. The guy's supposed to be in there, but he's not getting in there. Okay, that's miscellaneous. Okay, traitors. Um, I don't really think... Yeah, there's nothing new on these. Nothing new on DLC. Crafting, let's see. Chemistry. So we, got, we can get uh, powder and whatnot with this. To check out the fireworks. Chemistry stations, cooking stations. There's a stove. I utilize this stove a lot. If it looks good when you're when you like build a house and you know you can put that shit in there, like a kitchen area. Weapons workbench. So there's like a lot of upgrades. Cages. Um, I think the cages are all the same. Whoa, 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 what was that? Yeah, okay. This is a quitting time siren. So probably when you have all your workers working at your factory or whatever, you know, you're building. Okay, yeah. It looks like we went through all of them. So let's see. I uh, I got to I got to build something here. Just to demonstrate. I wanted to demonstrate to you guys the uh fireworks but I gotta build some stuff. If I would have known that, I could have already built and got stuff ready for you guys. But uh, here, let's try the scaffold. These you can pretty much put down anywhere. You know, just they connect and then just connect them. Wow. just put them anywhere I guess you just build and you put a you know flat one here but I don't know why they're not connecting like you know and then here's the boards oh my bad wrong sign yeah here are the boards uh, these ones fit on like the long ones that I just put down these can be uh, what's not going on there Here, let me separate them. I think it's because they're... Okay. Yeah, see, they go on. Pretty weird. Come on, stay down. Okay, there you go. Yeah, they go down. But, you know, like I said, they most likely, they all will fit. You just got to be creative and have patience. Put these stuff down. Okay. So 
So that's the scaffolding. Uh, let's try this. I want to try this. I seen the... Uh, I seen the elevators. Uh, I forgot where. Oh, here they are. Heck yeah. Let's do the tallest one. Requires five. So we'll bring that generator over here. Let's put this down here. Boom. All right. Let's bring this generator over here. No, I don't want to. We'll hook it up to that. All right. Okay. Let's check this out. This is cool. So. Oh, here we go, guys. Well. Wee. Yeah. Okay. That's not bad. This is nice. And you just go back down. See, let's go back down. Take me back down. Paradise City. Oh, shit. Second floor. All right. So you got it. Oh, okay. You can pick which floor you want. Awesome, man. Okay. So that's the elevator. That is cool. That's like the coolest thing. Okay. Next. Here, let's mess with this. Um, let's go inside my building here real quick. And we'll mess with the ball tracks. Make a little something something. I don't want to make this stream too long. I'm sure I already went long enough. And uh, hold on. Let me mute this. My dog's about to bark. Hold up. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I saw him getting ready to take off and start yakking. Okay, what was I doing? All right. Okay, this is a little bit difficult for me. Um, I've tried to put some down, but the difficult part is uh, they kind of they can stand up as high as you want them to, but if you're trying to make it realistic, it's sort of a challenge to put these up and actually make you know so let's try something here you know I, I was gonna do it in here but I might just take it outside but let me try this first before I okay oh yeah it'll fit so even though it goes through the bottom down below cuz I'm like I said I'm not gonna keep these these are just just to demonstrate to you guys here so let's put this back let's put this back here there you go all right now let's go back to the balls <laughs> ball track okay there it is and we'll put one of these I hope it attaches there you go awesome okay we'll start with this um let's see yeah, we'll start with this one. And I don't want, I don't know. See, like I said, this is just uh, a little experiment. Let's put some of the twists. Yeah. And then let's throw this one in there. How can I put this? Okay, well that's that's as simple I guess. Just as simple as for now. Like I said, I don't want to make this too long of a stream. So just a, just an example. Uh, now I need to find a freaking ladder. Damn it! There's just so much stuff on here now, and there's still a couple more DLCs coming. So <laughs> there's a lot of stuff to do, and it's pretty cool. By the way, drop a like. Uh, subscribe, share, comment, you know, I really appreciate that and uh, appreciate to the couple viewers that I have right now and thanks for 
taking the time and watch me mess up this whole thing. Oh, shit. Where is it? Okay, here it is. Yeah, there's just so many now. I just keep getting lost and confused. Okay, um... I want to get to a point where, okay, I'm going to drop it and then we'll jump down. Okay. Here it goes. Okay, ready? Go. Ah, shit, I didn't drop it. I thought I dropped it, man. Come on. Like I said, don't just watch me mess it up. Here we go. Here it comes. It kind of reminds me of the... I don't know if you guys ever played Metroid. Oh, that's cool. Awesome. So just imagine how long it would take for that thing to come down if you build an epic like an epic epic ball track which I'm on which I want to do and uh, if you subscribe you know you'll pretty much get the notification of me you know putting up videos making that shit so again check out my channel I've got a lot of different let's bills that uh, you can watch and enjoy they're about 20 30 minutes long you're not they won't take too much of your time and I know my contents not that great but uh try my best trying my best trying to come up with ideas to build and uh, stuff to do let's see what else can I demonstrate for you guys real quick I really wanted to do the fireworks but apparently I do not have the resources to make the shells. Hey, say hi to Deadpool. Yeah, also I can leave the description, leave the link in the description for this too. Uh, Deadpool. There's also a video on, you know, how to make it Out and here, stuff. You got to take things one day at a time. I think I put like how many squares to put down in the description and then start from there but here's another part of my build uh, this is supposed to be like a little boat dock obviously like it says bait and tackle worms and stuff then there's a med right here just in case you hook yourself and stuff and weapons <laughs> right next to the bait shop and here's just a little piece of the uh Yeah. Okay, see what else can I demonstrate for you guys? Let me see. Um Yeah, really I think I really just went through everything. And I literally went through every new bits and pieces that we've got so far. And uh please join me next time. Um I'm still trying to get a stream schedule. Like I just started streaming. I, I just decided to stream. And just to make a video for my channel. Something I can post. For you guys and I started with um literally no subscribers and now I'm up to two hundred and thirty, thirty one. And uh reaching for that three hundred. And then so on and so forth. Uh, obviously, 100,000 is the gold. But I don't know. That's just a dream. So let's let's see what this does here. Let me hook this up. Watch out, old man. I call him Popeye. Because, you know, kind of reminds me of Popeye. Okay, so I guess I can get a weapon. Do I have a weapon? Yeah, I do. I don't know what's more sore, my back. Awesome. Yeah, so I guess that releases uh it's like a release mechanism. I just I guess you just gotta hook it up to like a like a trap door. And then just Boom. Yeah. So that's what that does. 
Um, if you guys don't know where the trap door is at here, I'll show you guys where it's at. hope I don't start showing you the wrong stuff. Okay, here you go. It's on the defense. And it'll say traps. And here's the trap door. So you can literally just attach it. Let's see. Let's try that here. Uh, let's put a wooden... There you go. Okay, so we'll put it right next to there. And we'll put the trap. Hopefully it'll let us uh, lay it across like I did the other one. Yes, there you go. No, 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 no. It's not going to work. You know why? Because that trap door up here, it has to be stepped on. Let's see if there's one that is activated. Nope. Yeah, literally this won't work because this one you have to basically walk through it. Walk on top of it and, you know, fall and stuff. But if there is a floor that's made for this, uh, I'll probably eventually find it. So, let's see. Man, I really want it to display the fireworks, but that didn't seem to work out. Um, rugs, there's no new rugs. Oh yeah, there's pictures. I already showed you the pictures, uh, the statues, nothing. So I think that's pretty much it, guys. And um, I lost track of how many if you don't mind, uh, let me take you to my island. And we'll end the video there or end the stream there. Uh, we have to go all the way back to Far Harbor. And uh, sorry if you guys just joined. Um, pretty much to sum it all up the video I, I the stream I just uh, just went through all the items that came with the contraptions DLC uh, I tried to demonstrate some of them some of them I went through and of course the main the main event was gonna be the fireworks show but <laughs> stupid me I didn't bother to check to see if I had enough uh, resources, but uh, you know, if you hit, if you hit that subscribe button, man, you can uh, check out one of my videos that most definitely will have that in there. You know, the proper way of building, proper way of doing it. This one was just a quick run through tutorial guide, how to whatever you know. But I'm um, back here at Far Harbor, and. Um, Again, check out my channel, Master Smiley Gaming. I'm Master Smiley, uh, aka Low Tech. Um, oh shit, this is freezing on me. Please don't freeze. Oh man, I was like, no, don't crash. Okay, so let's go to Longfellow. <clears throat> I don't know, it's not letting me do anything. Yeah, anyways, yeah, this is Master Smiley Gaming, and I'm Master Smiley, a.k.a. Low Tech. Um, that's my PSN. If you guys are curious, you can hit me up and we can uh, play some Black Ops 3 or something like that. But I'm going to my settlement build here to finish out the stream. Just to give you guys a little idea of what kind of content I have on my channel. So I built this. Um, it probably don't look like much, but uh, the bottom's supposed to be a shelter, fallout shelter. I built this first, and later on, you know, I put these. I put this, I guess, a little, a small little mansion house over it. So let me, um, let me see. Where do I start? Let me start by taking you inside this house, and then we'll go underneath. But like I said, they're not connected. Uh, the house is just built over it. So it looks looks like this. Obviously, I use the uh, the barn, the barn pieces. So let's go inside. And I'm sorry if my stream cuts off. Uh, if that happens, you know, just keep an eye out keep an ear out you know for my next stream or you can again subscribe to my channel 
Okay, so this is the inside. I built this. I just put these stuff down, benches, trees, and I found this power armor on Far Harbor Island, of course. And here's my little living room, just a little chill ambiance. Pool area, which I haven't put no pool and sticks and stuff like that down yet. My little my little bar harbor, you know, you can get wasted over here, catch a buzz instead of fish. Kitchen area, as you can see, fucking Popeye's already taking advantage of it, man. Man. Oh, well. And, um, got my little reading section here, books and stuff, you know. <laughs> uh, I haven't gone and filled up these with books. It's going to be hard because I've tried to put books in there and they just fall through the shelf sometimes. And sometimes they fall through the floor when you drop them. And here's my restroom. You know, little ambiance. So just try to imagine, like, smelling like uh, incense and shit in there. Cover up all that smell. And here's my little chill area. Can just smoke a pipe or something and jam out. And this is supposed to be my food storage area. That's why there's a lot of shelves. And I am going to try to put canned foods, cream, and all that stuff in here. So I'll probably feature that later on. And we'll go upstairs. Here's my upstairs room, my tool house. Got my little lobby that you can chill. My tool room. Of course, my power armor that I'm repairing. That's all fucked up. Here's my tool room. And like a, you know, sort of a business fixing people's tools and shit sitting there okay and then here's a here's like a guest room i guess a bedroom you can come and sleep in extra bedroom the bathroom same thing you know nice and cozy even the restroom you know you don't want to leave it because it looks so comfortable in there try to put little things down my cups my bed iron right there and uh, we're gonna go outside. This is uh, the balcony goes to my guest house. I call it my guest house, which the door connects to right there. It, it takes you to that little place I was telling you about. So it goes in there, and here is my guest house. Let's go inside. This looks like a normal guest house. Nothing too fancy. It's not gonna be like, wow. But this is just normal guest house. Got your TV, you know, got your phone, camera. Even the main house don't have a phone. Bathroom, same, comfortable. This one's got a window. So that's why there's, you know, hardly any candles. So this is it. This is the... Oh, shit, I closed the door on myself. <laughs> okay, and then obviously this old man's utilizing this shit. In a little dick area. Okay, so let's go back downstairs. I want to show you the underneath. I don't want, like I said, I'm trying to wrap this up here. Uh, we'll go out this door. Damn fog's got my lungs. Yeah, 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 old man. And uh, here's my deck. Nothing too special, you know. Chill, drink my whiskey. Sit down in a little dog house here for dog meat. Got his own little lamp and little food bowl right there. And this one's on top. So we're up on top now. So. Okay, so let me go underneath now. And this is the bottom. Like I said, I built this first so it doesn't connect to the upper house. So this is a fallout shelter. It's just a little underground bunker. You got your basic water and your basic stove. And a few seats to sit. And there's no beds. There's no time to sleep if you're, you know. Fireplace, sit back. Marshmallow rolls and shit like that. Scavenger area. And that's that's about it on that. Simple. And I like how the... The door that goes to the shelter is hidden really nice. It's really nice. And, 
And this is what I wanted to show you guys too. Here's my worship center. <laughs> the Church of Adam. This is, uh, I guess, the Wastelanders religion. So, this is my Church of Adam. Uh, the outside. As you can see, I just put the, uh, the letters Church of Adam in sort of a cross sort of like a cross figure got my banners right there child child of Adam banners and before I take you inside let me just take you around uh, there's a path I made some paths with these uh, I just put fire barrels around and it looks nice too because the fog and you know it gives it that creepy that creepy element so there's another one there's a fence and if you follow these oil lamps you know, it'll take you right directly back to the mansion house. So it goes there, and it also can take you to Dog Meat's little feast area. It's got his dog bowl, and then, you know, his pail of water. Pretty, pretty big dog. So you just follow this, and here's electricity, run this. So let's go inside. So we're here at the Church of Adam. And I'll go slow for you guys so you can get a real good look. It's nothing special too. It's just uh, I just have benches, and I got their nuclear stuff that they worship, and a podium over there which we'll get to. And we'll look up at the corners here. So yeah, I have all these. I got the banners up on the walls. And we'll reach the podium. Got some there. And here's the podium. I don't want to get too close because those can be knocked off. I've done it before and it's shitty putting it back all up there. So that's the podium. And I think that's Longfellow. I didn't know what to put back there. <laughs> so I just stuck that portrait back there. So that's the church, guys. Um, if you want to see this build again, check out my channel. I have the, the build video for this. Uh... Again, my my build videos are like at least 30 minutes. You know, it's not that bad. I'm sure you can sit through it. So here's the yeah, here's the child of Adam, the church of Adam. That's where we go to worship um, Adam. Okay, so here's the path. We're gonna go down this path. There's one that goes down there, but we'll get there. But we'll take this path this way. Follow the oil lamps, and boom. There's my docking center, shipping dock. Uh, and I got some houses that I've built going this way. So we'll get to that so right now. Be out and about in the dark, hey, man, I'm fucking talking here. Shut the freak up. All right, let's go to this house first. There's Longfellow's uh, house. So here's a house that I built. Again, simple. I just tried to copy Longfellow's cabin, see if it can be built. And it can. And, uh... Here's the inside. It's same too, you know, couch, TV. It's pretty simple, straightforward. Not really too much stuff. And I try to keep my bills realistic. I don't want to have floating buildings and all these outrageous bills. I'm sure there's other videos out there that you can watch that does that kind of stuff. But uh, I keep it simple. And the fan. And oh yeah, I wanted to show you. This don't have no roof. I'm trying to keep it old school so, you know, you have having a nightmare and shit. The whole house will heal you. So then you can just go around this way. I got lobster traps and those floaters I was talking about that you can put down. And the house, I, I like this because I made it look like, see that how it's on stilts and stuff. Like little, you know, it's nice. And, uh, let me, before I go this way, let me show you the dock down below. This, uh, I just, a lot of these bills I'm showing you guys, um, they're not planned. I just, once I put something down, um, it just, whatever it turns into is just whatever it turns into. So originally I had this whole f floor covered here with boards, and it turned into this. So this is... Uh, like a like a chill spot while you're waiting you know say you're a sailor and 
you brought some material and products you know you can just wait around here your crew can chill if you brought your family they can sit around while they you know these ships being loaded or unloaded there's beer whiskey obviously there's fish you know you're taken care of man you're well taken care of here there's a grill if you want to cook there's a toy there for your kids to play with so they don't raise hell on this dock so there's fish everywhere docking bay obviously this is a fishing area and stuff like that we got our more fish more fish so obviously you know I tried to make it look like a shipping area and just made it look like this boat just couldn't quite make it <laughs> so that's that and we'll go down here we'll go down this way we'll go up here and I made some pass uh, we'll go up this path and this one connects from here and it goes to the outhouse right there and this goes up again I have all these bills in my on my channel so you want to check those out you want to see how these bills are made uh, you can check them out and this one goes upstairs this is my main house okay it's not like a house but upstairs there's an apartment so this is my business this whole building here is my fantasy business so this is a tavern tavern fountain obviously it's a seedy bar it's run down probably smells like piss you know so just imagine smelling rotten wood with pee and beer and whiskey so as you can see you know closing time people left there's bottles there's milk you want to sober up you don't want your wife or girlfriend to catch you drinking if you're not allowed to here's ice again simple obviously there's no cue sticks people fighting killing each other so there's none those consider weapons and here is my apartment this is where I work and live master smiley gaming right there got my posters got my employees only strict area my nice little chill for my employees they want to get paid or you know if I'm busy they can wait there and this is my chill area I'll sleep right there sometime I'll sleep there sometime I won't sleep at all here's my desk try to make it as desky as possible here's a a safe floor safe okay on to the next so this one uh, was one of my first builds when I came to this island and I connected this I just put this I put this pier or walkway and I'll show you guys this is one this is one of my favorite ones here this is nice I made this go all the way around the island so this goes down you know, this is a good way to get laid. This is a lover's walk. Nice scenery, man. Nice little lamps and oil lamps. You can see the ocean, smell the ocean. Right here is cool. This is a private spot. By the way, this island is a private island. It's my personal island. There's going to be no settlers here, nobody. Just me and Longfellow. I just pay him to keep tending this island here so this is the Just chill once. spot find a pair of socks that come over here play them. some chess like he's gonna do oh man check that out fucking asshole man so he dropped that that's a new vim drink if you're curious what that is chill spot here I and mean, just go down got some more fish there and here's sort of like a restaurant area <clears throat> the one thing I I failed to put down was the stove, but this is where you can actually just come to eat. You can go down here and swim. So you jump in fucking water, take a quick dip, and then you can just you know come back up. Tables, bring your ladies here. Cigarette machine if you smoke. If you notice, I have a lot of no smoking signs on this island, except for here. And it connects to here. I, I built this again. And they got my swimming area here. You can chill and put your feet in the water. 
And it goes up. You know, you can go cut across here if you want, but stick to the path. And it goes up here. This pier is just plain. I didn't want to decorate it. I wanted this just to just stay plain. So how it is, you know, just the way it is. I just put a few benches down. So that's that right there. And moving on. So this is the bottom half of the tavern fountain. This is the tuna garden. Now obviously this is a fish shop, like a fish market. And obviously down there, the pier, the shipping dock I, I showed you is where I get my products from. So this is it. Uh, obviously it needs to be restocked. A lot of these are empty. But it looks good, man. I like this too. Really nice. This was with the Far Harbor DLC. Okay. For those of you that just joined, um... I already pre-showed all the contraptions, like all the new materials that uh, came with the DLC. So uh, if you like, you know, stick around after the stream is done. And uh, you can go ahead and restart this video and I'll post and drop a like and comment and let me know. Here's Longfellows. So I showed you that and there's a little place right here too again. This is more like a, you know, you come over here and if you're thirsty like a little lobby like it says ice cold vim with the new vim machine here and nuka cola ice and milk nothing special you can sit right there and drink your drinks chill so that's about it guys for this uh, I just wanted to show you my island real quick and just a small little short bills that uh I've made and I've posted on my channel and again please check out my channel uh, I have quite a few bills you know drop a like on them comment share and uh, I'm well over 200 subscribers I'm trying to reach a thousand a hundred thousand maybe someday a million you know you guys are awesome and uh, keep the compliments coming yeah some of you guys have been complimenting my videos and giving me tips and stuff and it's really cool you know I really like uh, interaction with you guys and I had a few questions on uh, about some of my music that I put uh, to my let's build videos um, there's a few that are mine that I actually made on my own those are all some of them are originals those are I, I made the tracks myself and some of them I got off of YouTube I don't know if you guys know, there's a video creator on YouTube where they have uh, free copyrighted music that you guys can use. So, but I'll leave links in the description. And if it's my own music, you know, I don't mind. I I'll put the download link in and can share it. I'm not going to sell it or anything. You can share it. And if you want to maybe use it on one of your vids, you know, you can go ahead and message me and we'll see. And, uh,. Again, this is my island, man. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed the contraptions. I know I wanted to show you guys the fireworks. <laughs> but uh, I uh, apparently I didn't have no more uh, resources. So, uh, again, drop a like. If you can, subscribe. I don't know how many times I said this throughout the whole video. And uh, check out my church again. Let me, I like this church. It's really creepy. And uh, comment, share. And uh, just let me know what you think of the bills. Let me know what you think about this island. Uh, there's a lot more bills to come. A lot more streams to come. And uh, I guess we'll call it here, guys. Uh, I'm Master Smiley. This is Master Smiley Gaming. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next stream. Hopefully in a couple days or maybe later on this afternoon. And uh, again, have fun. Enjoy the rest of the day. It's about 6 o'clock here uh, where I'm at. And it's already scorching hot. So uh, again, drop a like, comment. You guys are awesome. You guys are great. For you viewers, you know, if you're new, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. And I'm out of here, guys. Later, gamers. <laughs>